Hello, Rowan. G'day, Eddie. How you going? Welcome aboard, mate. Rowan Harbinson is unemployed. He's 21 years of age. He's going to study transport logistics. Yep. Is that right? Yep. What's transport logistics all about? No idea. I'm giving a bash, though. Yeah. <laughs> what, you just put your sword on a poster or something, did yeah, you? Yeah, pretty much so. And, uh, Thought I'd go with it. What will that lead you to, do you know? Um, anything and everything. <laughs> yeah. You've got no idea, have you? No. Uh, okay, <laughs> now, tell me, your dad, he bet you 30 bucks you wouldn't get past $1,000. Yeah, we were talking at dinner one night, and uh, he sort of bet me then, and I was like, all right, I'll take you up on that challenge, so... You know, <laughs> it'll be funny. <laughs> <laughs> I like your attitude, mate. Let's get stuck into this. You must answer this one, OK? All right, I'll give you, it a bash. Mate, you've got to get three questions to win 30 bucks. <laughs> All, right, All right, sweet. Here we go, Rowan. Which of these is a drinking fountain? Dribbler, dripper, bubbler, tinkler? Well, I don't think it's tinkler, because that name is absolutely hilarious. Um, I'm probably going to go with the bubbler. Number C. Number C. <laughs> Where to see, whatever. Right, okay. <laughs> That's like getting number C. <laughs> number C. Oh, you're not going to believe this. Bubbler is correct for 300. <laughs> yeah. All right, here we go for 500. The logistics superstar one day. You never know. Guns are a colloquial term in bodybuilding for which muscles? A. Abdominals. B. Biceps. C, hamstrings. D, gluteals. I don't gluteals. think it's a, abdominals. Your guns. I'm going to go for biceps on this one. Lock you know. in B, biceps? Yep. It's locked in. Give us a look at the guns here, Rowan. Um, well, it's gonna... mostly fat. <laughs> <So> <laughs> I, I think you're probably best off asking someone with actual muscle. <laughs> Ed was just falling off his chair up the back there. It's lovely, this. <laughs> guns and biceps are correct for 500. <laughs> You're absolutely a six pack. Yeah, I, I've of got yours, a beer gut, so uh, I, I really don't know. Your six pack's turned into a keg, has it? Uh, more <laughs> a liquor store, so. <laughs> okay. <laughs> oh, no, not going there. Uh, hammies, and of course, the glutes are elegantly referred to as buns. Your glutes. Fair enough. You know that? I had no idea. You been to a gym before? Um, have, you yes. have you driven past one? <laughs> <laughs> Walked past one while going to Macca's, but still. No, hey, that works, Rowan. Yeah. Mate, the next question's for a thousand. You're two questions away from making your dad pay you 30 bucks. I'm pretty excited about that. All right, we'll find <laughs> out if the great man can go all the way right after this in the hot seat. <laughs> Rowan Harvison comes onto the hot seat. With two, two goals in mind here. To win $1 million, and he's in the hot seat to do that. He can just keep going. 11 more questions, he'll win $1 million. But if he gets the next two right, do you have to get 1,000 or 1,500? 1,000. You have to get 1,000. If you get this question right, your father has to pay you 30 bucks. He of such little yeah. faith. <laughs> <laughs> yep. <laughs> Come on, let's go for it. It's, we're up on Rowan here. To this stage, Rowan, this could be the biggest moment of your life. You never know. You never know you're like <laughs> in a big city. Come on, mate, let's go for a thousand. A famous slogan in Australia in the years after World War II was what or perish? A, populate. B, poor. C, pride. D, parliament. I'm not actually sure on this one, Eddie. Twelve seconds. Populate or perish, poor or perish, pride or perish, parliament or perish. I think it was pride or perish. C. Four seconds, four seconds, three seconds. What are you gonna do? Well, you can do anything you want. Lock in C. Lock in C. Rowan. <laughs> <laughs> Man, I was trying to get you to the other P. Pass. <laughs> I was thinking of that, but you know, it's all good in the hood. <laughs> <laughs> Rowan, I want you to look down that camera. Over there, camera number four. No, there's one over with the red light right, going. Okay, right? okay, over there. Yeah. I'm with it. Look down there, what's your dad's name? David. David, is he a good man, da David? Um, he's funny. Is he? <laughs> <laughs> I want you to point down that camera. Say, <laughs> Dad. Dad. You. You. Were. Were. Right. <laughs> <laughs> right. <laughs> 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 oh, 
Oh, mate, I, I want to give you 30 bucks. <laughs> 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 Mate, I tell you what, we've never done this before in Millionaire, OK? We're going to give you 30 bucks. <laughs> <laughs> You've just been fantastic, mate. The, the answer, by the way, is uh, populate or perish, OK? So as A, underline the major immigration program at the time. Thank you, Paul. Mate, um, this is a bottle of... What, what champagne is that? Um, I'm going to guess... M Moway? I don't know, it sounds cool. <laughs> no, no Moe is where they wear moccasins, mate. This is, <laughs> this is Moet and Chandon. It's free oh. champagne. Is this like giving strawberry to pigs? I'm not sure. <laughs> probably. <laughs> probably. <laughs> mate, we we'll just give you a bourbon and a cake. What do you reckon? Or the champagne? Sounds good. Take the champagne, buddy. You've been oh, fantastic. Thank you, mate. Right on, mate. <laughs>